the Chow Chow Chow, Stancer and Joe here. Welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Jade Trial Run. In the last episode, we made a start to our adventures here in the region, and we made it right here to this city. What is this city called? Avenant Bay, a tiny, uh, pleasant spot where the land kisses the ocean. Hmm, nice. And today we're going to go further on, we're going to go to Route 2 and the Steamlet Cave and see what is going on. Our team, so far, is... Once I figure out how to do this, because it's been a while since I've played on Joypad uh, with my controller mod. Anyway, so we have Maple, our uh, Malif, uh, Grass type, possibly Glass Flying, I don't know, Naughty Nature, with these stats, Overgrowth for the ability, Tackle, Growl, Absorb, and Leech Seeder on the moveset. Then we have Billy. Billy is a bold-natured copy Porter. Copy Boda? Copy Boda. I'm going to say that. Anyway, it's going <laughs> to... For all these fakey mod, it's going to be hard to figure out how to pronounce them and everything. Anyway, Billy has a bold nature, has these stats with pick up for the ability, tackle and growl on the moveset. I'm going to have, I think today, we should probably put Billy up front. Maple's already level 9, so it would be a good idea to do that. I'm realising my... I need to turn that down. The music's good here, but like I need to turn it down. Sometimes it's like regular old third gen music, but sometimes it's, a, it's its own custom thing. That's cool. I'm not interested in it. I'm not interested in you. Go away. I do not like early bug types. I'm not a fan of bug... Well, like... I'm a fan of the later bug types. You give me Caesar or a Sizzle or a Pincer or a Heracross any day and I will say yes. Hell, I'll even go to Scolopede and say that I would even pick that up as a team. It's their base evolutions up as a teammate. But, as for, you know, I now need to heal. <laughs> can I run? I can. Somehow I'm faster than another Capybora. Anyway, uh, yeah, as I was saying, I will pick them up any day of the week. But if you give me like a Weedle or a Canopy... Don't tell Hardy this, but I really would throw it would throw it in the bin. And I say don't tell Hardy that because the fact is, me, uh, Hardy is one of my idols. Like he is one of the uh, Hardy Tech Yo Yo is one of the many many reasons why my channel still exists to this day. Awesome, awesome uh, Pokechip Bo was Hardy back in his day, and it just I miss him very much, so. Right, time for our f uh, time for a trainer bar. L oh, we got that bird thing again. I I kind of still want to find that bird thing and cat uh, uh, pick this up. This kabari. I still wouldn't mind picking one of these up. It looks pretty cool as a mon, and I wouldn't mind picking it up one day. But we'll have to see. I mean, to tell you the truth, I'm excited to see what all these Pokemon evolve into. Some not so much more than others because, you know, again, that Maggle or whatever it's called, uh, uh, old, I'm not interested. Like, it could evolve into its base form and I'm still not interested in this darn thing. Ow. Okay, I need to get out of here. Because this Cappy, uh, that Habari is doing a lot of damage to, uh, to me. And uh, Billy is dying. I know this is not a Nuzlocke, but I still like to keep my Pokemon alive so they gain experience, you know. And I'm not running back to heal after every battle, except the fact I am running back to heal after every battle at this moment in time. It's the first start. It's the first start to the game, guys. That's basically what you're doing. Until your Pokemon sort of 
get an idea for what battling is and actually learn to do it properly, they're gonna they're gonna run into some troubles. But once they've got an idea for it, everything's fine. And usually for me in my Nuzlocke series, that means I have to do like a smart, I have to do a little grinding montage, get my team up to like level, t uh, get the team of Pokemon I want to use up to like level 10 for every one of them and then start actually fighting the trainers and, you know, going for going for the gym battles once they've realized hey this is actually this is this is what you're dealing with now you know your days of running around the forests leaping and trying to f uh, leaping about for orange berry trees to find well they're done what the hell is that thing and i i want it i want it now that looks like a fire type, and I'm very, very, I'd be very, very excited to bring up a Taz Torch. I want this thing. I mean, I, I, I crit, I'm sorry I crit your thing. Your Taz Torch. Like, I, I love fire types. I'm a huge fan of fire type. Most fire type designs I actually pretty much like. Then maybe one or two I don't. Mean cargo. <laughs> but that is a cool Pokemon. If you if I can find that, I will pick it up immediately. Oh my god, I found it! I spoke it into existence, ladies and gentlemen. Let me catch this. Give me this. One, two, Lantern Gem. Thank you. Thank you, game. Taz Torch are common among uh, uh, being investigate are common for being investigators with other young Pokemon in the Amolda Amara region. They bought. Uh, their bright flaming tail can uh, burn for um, on can burn almost any surface. The Tasmanian Devil Pokemon. Cool. Uh. Well, since it's Taz. <laughs> No, no, you can't name it that. Um, don't, I don't really don't know what to call this. Um, is that how you spell it? Let me check this out because I'm going. I'm going to. Who need to know how to spell this if it doesn't work? That'll be a cut, you know. Yeah, that is how you spell it. All right, so there we go. I'm going to call you Task Mission. After the finishing move of one of my favourite wrestlers as a kid, Taz. So let's take a look at Taz's mission here. Okay, so Dark Fire type, Sassy Nature. Uh, these are its stats with Flash Fire for the ability, Scratch and Leer on the moveset. I like this thing. I am very much interested in using this. So, very much interested in using that. That is my fire type. I, hello, I'm a gentleman. I am gen, uh, I am facing Gentleman Joe. And I am a gentleman, yes. Well, actually, my brother's a gentleman. I'm just a ro I'm the roadie, but <laughs> like, there isn't a Pokemon trainer class called Roadie Joe yet. 
I guess. I guess the def I guess the uh, Pokemon trainer class that we're closest enough would be like Hiker Joe. Even though I always see myself as like a Pokemon Ranger, but you know, and that's a level six one. That's cool. I'm not sure if I'm ready to go into a. You know, a cave, yeah. You know, a steamlet cave. I'm gonna have to probably like go and uh, heal before we actually get in there. Oh, crit! Beautiful move there, Billy. I mean, if you could get there, we go. There's level nine for Billy. Okay, I'm okay. You're gra that thing is a grass fairy type, and I do like it. But I'm not really interested in picking it up at the moment in time. Escape rope, I will take. What's that? Okay, uh, ma mapri, marip, marpeep, marpeep. I caught you. Now we're friends, companions, buddies. Ma, what's wrong, uh, Ma Peep? You've got nothing to be afraid of. Hey, I'm shy too. Come on, uh, we can talk about we can talk about it. I'll make you feel better. Ma Peep, Peep, Peep. Really, I promise. I'm not going to hurt you. I'll prove it. My peep. No. Oh, what have I done? Hey, mate. Did you see that? How embarrassing. My name is Axel. I'm a new Pokemon trainer from Avenant Bay. I just caught my first Pokemon on this route. The uh, first Pokemon I saw, and, well, you saw what happened. My peep f uh, got frightened and bottled it into the ca into the Steamlet Cave. He's shy, like me. Like me! To be quite honest, I was going to train that my peep before coming in there. It seemed scary. I can't seem to find him in there myself. Maybe you can help me out. What do you say? Can you go in there and find my peep for me? I don't really owe you big time. Sure, we'll go and do that. Thank you so much. I'll be waiting out here. Good luck. Let's rescue my peep uh, from Steamlet Cave and return it to Axel. Quests are in this game! I love it! I'm just going to run away from you right now, though, because I kind of need to go and heal. But I'm definitely going to... Ca I am definitely going to help you with, uh, rescue your Mapeep. What the hell is that thing? If that is supposed to be like your early Rock-type Pokemon, your, your Geodude, for example, I'm not interested. If that is your early Geodude. Although I do like Gollum, so... You know, it does evolve into something uh, amazing at the end of it, so... I could say that I might be interested in, like, a, an early Rock-type Pokemon, but... I'm not sure. I will take it out, though, because I kind of need the uh, experience, and I also need to go and run back and heal. Before we go into the Steamlet Cave, I need to run back and heal. Although, if I could run into my own my peep, I'd be interested in, you know, catching it. Can I run into my own my peep? I ran into my own my peep! Let's see about... what. Okay, so what is this thing? No, 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 you don't understand. You, you, come with 
me now. I own you. See? He understands, ladies and gentlemen. He understands. Okay, so it's a psychic Pokemon. My people are playful and uh, uh, and loving to their trainers. But in battles, they use their clownish mischief uh, to their advantage. Okay, interesting. Very, very interesting. Um, Krusty. If that's not how you spell it, I'll go to the name Raider later. You know, when we find him and I'm going to call him that. But I want to name him after Krusty the Clown from, Sp uh, from you know, The Simpsons. Right, let me run back to the Pokemon Center and then we'll start actually doing stuff here. Because I also want to look at Frosty too. I'll have time to where uh, on the layout that'll be it'll be the correct spelling if that's not the correct spelling. Because I'll have time to fix it. Uh, you know, because I'll have time to write it out and Google and f and figure out how to actually spell it. So there you go. I'll do that in just. I'll do that in you know. I'll do that in editing. You know, I'm making the layout. I can't fix it now if it's the wrong spelling. But here we go. Krusty is a psychic type. Has a sassy nature. These are its stats with synchronized for the ability growl. It's Ralts. I know it's not Ralts, but. It's Ralts. It knows no attacking moves. It has nothing good going for it. And there's a Dandrot! I'm not interested in Dandrot. But... I'm glad I caught one of these, my peeps. I'm not actually... I don't know if I'm going to be picking it up and actually using the thing, but... And there's a cat... A Kabori! I mean, I could try and pick it up and maybe you... Uh... Oh, I only have one Pokeball. I only needed one Pokeball. The Kukibora Pokemon. Although it is a favourite for bird lovers, Kobori is more is a more serious Pokemon than cute. Uh, than it is cute. It rarely shows affection. Okay. Interesting. Very, very interesting. My name for Noctowls is uh, Wise, and I kind of want to call it. I kind of want to call it that too, because it's sort of an owl, and I like. I like to think that well, owls are quite wise and know a lot. All right, so let's take a look at Wise. Now I have to buy more Pokeballs when we get to the next town, so here's Wise, level 3, normal flying type, rash nature, somewhat stubborn, has these stats with Keen Eye for the ability, Tackle and Leer on the moveset. In between episodes I will probably do a bit of grinding. I've been trying to find my way out of this cave for days. Being a... Uh, Legally blind is tough. Don't I, don't you know? I mean, I would say probably yes. I mean, I don't really know for sh myself, so I can't really help you out here, mate. But yeah, I I could see that being tough for some 
uh, I'm trying to get out of a cave. This is a very interesting cave. That's that stegmite again. Not interested, really. And this is a grape, a gren, grenade. Again, not really interested. Looks like it would be a ground bug type. Oh, super potion, nice. I should not be getting super potions this early, but I'll take them nonetheless. What is down here? Okay. I mean, can I put Taz up front and uh, switch it out to either Maple or Billy to help me out here in these caves? Because I want to get Taz some experience. Um, in between episodes, I probably will be getting experience on my... Oh, you have your own Taz! I'm going to go to Billy on this. Just in case, because I don't get my ass booked uh, by this uh, by this other Taz. Nor do I want to get my, uh, nor do I want to bring uh, Maple in here just in case it has a fire type move. I don't think it does, but you never know. Oh yes, I forgot. I turned on. Uh... You have the water type starter. Okay, I'm getting my ass whooped by this thing. He's a... I don't like the poison sting. I mean, at least I didn't get poison from that. I know it does have a 30% chance of poison, which kind of is a little scary, I will tell you that. Well, you're not poison type yet, so I can still do super effective damage with my, uh, with my grass type move. Oh, you're trying to learn Bullet Seed. Okay, I mean, guess get rid of Growl for that. Nice work, Maple. Uh, do I have potions? I do. Not a lot of them, but... There you go. A PP or... That's cool, I'll use that later. Item. Oh, a rare candy. Nice. Thanks, game. What is here? Stegmite is here. I'm going to run away from that thing. Cannot run away. There's my peep. Ma. Wait. Oh, you came in here yourself. Okay. My peep. My peep, I'm so sorry for scaring you earlier. I just want us to be the best uh, of friends. None of that matters. The only thing I care about is that you're okay. Peep? My peep peep peep? Aw, oh, my peep. I'll never lose you again. Joe, thank you so much for finding my peep. Who knows uh, what horrible things uh, could have happened without you. Alright, buddy, return. I just don't know how to repay you, Joe. Oh, I got it. How about a battle? Uh, how about no? <laughs> My peep and I could do uh, do with some practice for strengthening our bond. I'm warning you, Joe. I may be shy, at, but I take battling very seriously, and I never back down from a challenge. Let's do this. Oh, 
All right, here we go. So, he's level 7. I am level 5. But, I think he's only going to have Growl. So, we might be here a while. But this is going to be some valuable experience for Taz Mission. And eventually, I might even get crits every now and then, so... You know. This is probably going to be the entire episode, the rest of the entire episode. I will admit, I mean, we're 25 minutes in, so... Oh, you have confusion now! I mean, it's a good thing I'm a dark fire type, isn't it? So I can't get hit by that. Well, at least I know my own my peep only uh, uh, gains uh, will gain ta uh, will gain confusion at level seven as well. Then I hope, unless they're cheating just by giving him confusion to try and uh, uh, to try and catch you out, even though your uh, your version won't learn it for several uh, several levels. Pokemon's done that before. I'm you know, I've got first hand experience of that. One more scratch should kill from here. There we go. Not bad, Taz Mission. And Taz Mission learns Ember. That was a lot of fun. I've already learned so much from you, Joe. I truly hope I'll see you again on my journey. From now on, uh, Maple, uh, my peep, sorry, uh, my peep, and I are heading back to Avenant Bay to, tr to train on Route 1 so we can get stronger. Maybe we'll even meet a new friend. Who knows? Regardless, Joe. See you. Thanks again. That was pretty cool. I like that. I like that. I like it when a game has story. Can I run now, please? I mean, if he's going to keep on leering me, I could just hit the M. I missed. Damn it. <laughs> sure, I'll use next Pokemon. Billy, come in here and finish this thing, please. There we go. Anyway, I'm going to go and get on out of here. Uh... Alright, fine. I guess I'll go and battle. I guess I'll battle you first. Let me beat up this uh, Stegmite, and then we'll, uh, uh, and any other Pokemon this uh, thing has. Uh, I'm recording this Sunday morning, so, uh, no, 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 I'm not recording this Sunday morning, I'm recording, what the hell is that thing? Lo Wednesday morning, I'm recording this Wednesday morning, and I'm hoping the bin, uh, that's bin day for me, so I'm sort of hoping the bin lorries don't come. Before I finish off this video. Because otherwise I'm going to be in a slight bit of... Well, it's not going to be best for my audio. So, I think I might end uh, you know, end off this episode here. Oh. So there's that thing. Okay, so that's what it looks like, uh, you know, outside of Trainer Pals. Yeah, I think I might end off this episode here, and then in the next episode, we'll go further on. Into the cave, and uh, see if that's the way out. Actually, is, is this the way out? Because if I can find that before the end of this episode, I will be quite happy. Okay, so you have one of these, too. 
a lavar. I mean, bullet seed should kill you before you have chance to do anything with that bide, hopefully. There we go, level 12. And now you're losing... Now you're learning poison powder? I mean, I'll get rid of absorb for that. You learn a lot of good moves whilst trying to level up. I like that. And we're at the cave in Somerville City. Cool. Uh, there seems to be a lot of cowboys around. I want to find the Pokemon Center before... Oh, I found the exit to the city. I wanted to find the Pokemon Center. There it is. So it seems like something is going on in this city. I'm not going to go and explore. I'm not going to go and explore. I'm just going to heal. And we're going to end off today's episode here. In between episodes, I will go and grind. And by Friday's episode, we'll be ready for whatever the hell's going on in this city. Everyone should be about the same level. Like 11 or 12 is where I'm planning to go. Maple doesn't need any more levels. He is the right level. Billy needs maybe one, maybe two, and then everything else is where I'm going to be focusing my attention. Uh, to get some of these up, I may need to do some switch training. Uh, but, uh, and that may give Maple and Billy some levels. So, I want to apologize for that now, just in case. But that is the plan. Oh, do you, you have a pickle by them already? Cool, I'll take that. Thanks, Billy. Anyway. Uh, we're going to end off today's episode here. So if you enjoyed today's episode, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more. Join us next time where we will be exploring this beautiful city of... What is it called again? Sunny, uh, Sun, Sunnyville City. We'll be exploring Sunnyville City and seeing what is going on with all these cowboys. But anyway, until next time, I'm Lancer and Joe. Mean to the Pokemon gets lesser. Everybody get Pokemon. Good night! Thank you very much for watching. If you did enjoy, then please consider leaving a like, comment, and subscribe. You can follow me on Twitter, at Lantern Joe, where you'll get news, thoughts, and opinions from me and the rest of the Lantern Nation. You can also check out these two videos in the top right and top left-hand corner. And don't forget to check out Power Zone Metal. It's a weekly radio show where you can listen to heavy metal music and so much more. You can find out more information about that at powerzonemetal.uk But until next time, I am Lantern Joe and I will see you next time.